One of the reasons I'm so open with my life is because there's been times when I've heard someone else's story and it's helped me heal or it's helped me get through whatever situation it is that I'm going through. So I feel like as a writer and as an actress, it's only right that I'm completely open and completely honest because somebody else is listening to me. And even if it's one person, they're, they're listening to me and they're watching me and, and who knows what they've been through that I my story may be healing for them. So that's why I'm very open about everything in my life. And it's pretty much, I'm an open book. One day you wake up and you realize you're living that dream that you had last night. Poetry. <laughs> Poetry has been somewhat of a timeline in my life. It's like to find all these significant things that I've been through. Welcome to Outside Myself. I'm so happy that you could be here in this moment with me. Tonight, you can call me Sparkle. It's a nickname my mother gave me that stuck until I got to college. But today, all my family and close friends still call me that. So if you're here with me tonight, then you are close friends and family. I have declared this the year of now or never. No more next time, next year, maybe later, or after I lose 10 pounds. Like that's gonna happen. It's now or never. So tonight I just wanna sit down and have an intimate conversation with you to let you know who I am, where I'm going, what I'm doing, but more importantly, how I got here. I got here by defying all the odds, sneaking past the guards, but always telling the truth when I got caught. You know, secretly, I've always wanted to be a singer. I love them, love them, baby. <laughs> thank you, thank you, thank you. Sexual chocolate, sexual chocolate. That girl good. When I first discovered this about myself, I practiced and practiced with all my heart. And then I stood up in front of my parents' TV and belted out Karen White's Superwoman at the top of my lungs. I'm not your superwoman. Mm -hmm. Luckily, I have God. He's all that I need. And when I die, my soul will be free. Luckily, I have God. Thank you, Father, for having me. And what's interesting about me as a poet is I felt like at times I was the greatest poet. And then there's been times I felt like I didn't even want to hear my own voice as a poet. And at first, I don't quite understand it. But then, like lightning, it hits me. All this fear and all this searching. I realized what I was looking for. I was looking for myself. And I don't want the world to see me. I just don't think that they'd understand. When everything's made to be broken, I just want you to know who I am. I was a ball of raging fire. And everything just happened real fast after that to have locks to make me a poet. I see the funny looks when I hit the mic. The questioning stares, is she for real? Is she all right? Don't she know what perms do? She's obviously not conscious. Doesn't she know the to be a poet rules? Is that a weave? Her hair can't be that long. It's a little burned out. Does she use a straightening comb? Poor girl, let's take her in. She needs some sun, let's darken up her skin. As far as being treated like a queen, 
My man knows how to fulfill my needs But I wanna work for it Sometimes I wanna say please Mr. Shiver, you never made me ask for a thing You are always on that Whatever you like My African queen Finally I pushed him away completely I felt like I saved him though because I was just a time bomb waiting to blow anyone close to me up. From James Brown toe tapping, heating up the place. Place, 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 place. My mental genius has the leverage to be free where Elvis Presley creativity welcomes. Most of the poems that I perform tonight, they're pieces that I've never performed in front of an audience before. The songs, they're like a soundtrack to my life. And the stories, the stories are secrets that I've hid from the world and at times from myself. I'm finally free. So now you know I sit down when I pee and I pray on my knees. God loves me and he is my king. Yeah, I sit with the gift of repentance redeems my soul. poetry and I, it may be because naturally I always wanted to be a singer and naturally I see myself on stage performing music so I, in my transition I had to make poetry my music but it in real life musicians inspire me so much songs inspire me music inspires me I love musicians like it does something to my soul. Like I could hear a certain song and it can change my whole mood. I love music so much. Puff it, puff it. 